Did you ever just want to have the perfect scrambled eggs recipe they can master every single time just within 15 minutes? Then give this simple recipe a try. That works every time. So you're going to need one deep circular pan they are going to work with the eggs and scramble them. This only needs one pan for the entire work. Now let's get onto the cooking. So first of all, you need to crack four entire eggs. To the egg mixture, we're going to be adding a little bit of butter for the really creamy texture. As for the creme fraiche, or you can just use sour cream or just normal cream. It's gonna be used in the middle of our cooking because we don't want it to burn too quickly. Now we get on the stove and do the rest of the cooking. Because we want it to be light and fluffy, we're gonna put it on very low heat so it can cook slowly. Add your pan on there. You can see the butter is still in a chunk, but that's exactly what we want because we want it to be evenly spread out all over the entire mixture. We just wanna gently scramble at this moment and let the butter just melt throughout the mixture. You want to alternate putting it on the stove and off the stove, which is make it have a very creamy texture. Put 30 seconds off the stove and 30 seconds on the stove. We want the cooking to be even on the eggs. Try your best to continually stir because the last thing you want is lumps to start forming. So in the middle of our cooking, just so the salt is not caramelized before, we're going to be adding a bit of salt. Make sure to stir that well through. To this, you can add dry chives or fresh chives. But I like to add dry chives just because they have a stronger flavor. Once you see egg coating the side of your pan and it's hard to remove, you know you're doing a great job. Once the consistency is about like this, lumpy but not too lumpy, you know you're done. Now, at this moment, you can turn off the heat. Now for the plating. We're gonna add our plate, take our well toasted toast that was cut in half. To this, we're gonna be adding our fresh scrambled eggs. We're gonna be laying a bed over the toast. To that, we're gonna be adding some dry parsley, some dry chives, and just a touch of cilantro. And here you have it, your perfectly scrambled eggs. As always, we're gonna have a taste test and go for a big bite you can't explain how good this is you get that creaminess from the creme fraiche you get the saltiness from the salt and the butter and the butter just makes it so silky smooth since we took so long to cook the eggs it became so silky so smooth and it's a wonderful meal to eat thank you guys so much for watching as always if you enjoyed this recipe Please like the video, subscribe to our channel for more videos just like this, and turn the post notifications on so you get notified every time we upload a video. Thank you guys so much for the support, it really means a lot to us. And as always, peace out.